welcome to Las Palmas de Gran Canaria and I have some incredible news. I'm so happy right now. Yesterday I met up with the Norwegian people that I met only briefly in the harbor of Cascais, Portugal and I stayed in contact with them and I met with them yesterday for a couple of beers because they said I might be able to join them across the Atlantic. We had a really good connection, we talked for hours and now they decided that I can sail with them across the Atlantic. We're gonna start sailing in three days and tomorrow I will be able to move on their boat. So I'm, I'm really really happy and then we have to do the huge provisioning. Yeah, all kinds of instructions and they have to show me all their boat and yeah, it's gonna be really really amazing. Sailing across the Atlantic is gonna be such a huge milestone for this project, hitchhiking around the globe and it gave me quite a headache because it was this part where I might get stuck somewhere and you know the season where people are sailing across the Atlantic is limited. It's usually from October to February and right now it's like the beginning of January so I don't have that much more time and they're actually next to the harbor here in Las Palmas which is the biggest harbor of the Canary Islands. There are like 30 hippies camping next to that harbor, sleeping in tents on the beach, which is amazing, but they all want to find a boat. And it's, it's like such a high demand for people who want to hitchhike a boat and not so many boats are going. So it would be like really difficult for me to find a boat if I wouldn't have found the Norwegian people. And I'm so glad that they waited for me and they gave me the space and they also liked my project. That's why they kind of wanted to have me on the boat. Yeah, I mean, then I'm gonna be in the Caribbean. How crazy is that? Next big chapter. I didn't forget about you. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> so this is my new captain. Yeah. This is the, the Viking chief, me. <laughs> the real captain. Yeah. And this is Astrid. Yeah. Hello. Viking number one. Yes. <laughs> and meet Captain Idun, aka Viking number two. <laughs> so Idun, what are we doing right now? We're shopping for. Um, Groceries, well, vegetables. Yeah. We're gonna buy stocking up. For we're gonna a long buy passage. everything they have here. <laughs> Thirty times two. Yes. So. One hundred and twenty x. Yeah, that should be enough. More. <laughs> we need to eat them as well. Yeah, no, that's more than enough, I think. Yeah. Okay, so. Oh my three. God. Day. Today we will start sailing in the evening across the Atlantic. How crazy is that? And it's like we could be like four weeks or even more on sea, but probably about three to four weeks. And then it's kind of crazy to leave the land if you think about that because I'm really looking forward to that time and the digital detox and all the good food we will have and the good time we will have and the adventure of it. But then you just standing here and you think like okay for one month I will see nothing except water and you appreciate this ugly building over there and 
you appreciate for the last time the solid ground on your feet and you might as well even lay down and just enjoy nothing is moving <laughs> and now we could buy everything we wanted but soon there's just gonna be us and the things we have on the boat and nothing else so you think like do we did we forget something did we get get enough food did we get, get enough water which is the most critical thing but yeah i think we did a good job provisioning and i'm really excited for the crossing 2737 miles across so we go south we go southwest and then we go west all right west. Not west. Hitchhiking around the globe west. Yeah. 2,000 and what miles do you say? 2,737 miles. That sounds good. Yeah. I'm in. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> it's not too late to turn around. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. So, enjoy. Thank you. You, you too. too. Yes. Yeah. yeah. All right. I'll start with the last one. Yep. So, one ended up to help us from pushing up. Okay, no. Mi amor. Mi amor. <laughs> okay, okay, we're free. Let's go. Yep. Yeah, okay. It's pretty good. Yeah, and then it's this line as well. Oh. I'm gonna back us out actually. So crazy with all these lines going yeah, yeah, in the yeah, water. Yeah. Oh yeah. At the very start of our trip, we got one in the propeller. Really? In Norway. Nine degrees in the water. Wow. Oh shit. Yeah, that's it. You had to dive? Yeah. How long did it take to get it out? Oh, uh, like, uh, not long, but I had to go down maybe three times to get all the ropes up and stuff. Mm. Get wavy. Done with that view. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was an absolute dream start to our Atlantic crossing. The weather treated us with lovely soft winds, helping us to find our sea legs again. The vessel felt very safe and was well maintained with a rig inspection just completed. And the crew, I could not have wished for any other crew than this one to cross the Atlantic with. The two girls, Idun and Astrid, are owners of the vessel Kokos and are a happily married lesbian couple. Astrid is a nurse and Idun already crossed the Atlantic and the Pacific before. Simon is also from Norway and also an experienced sailor and engineer. Together we formed a dream team, dreaming together about arriving to our dream destination, the island Martinique in the Caribbean. And our cute pirate dog completed the crew. We trained her to do her business on a grass mat on the deck. Which worked out most of the time. Oh my god, it looks delicious. Yeah, what are you making? I'm making like a coleslaw type thing, you know? mm -hmm. but normally I do it with like yogurt, but we don't have yogurt, so I'm trying with mayonnaise, and for now it just seems like it's making avocado mayonnaise, but mm. we'll see how it turns out. Now I'm gonna wrap it in an omelette. Oh. Oh, oh. The coleslaw, yeah. Whoa, <laughs> playing the ball games. Mu is handling it pretty good. Yeah, she she's like better for you. <laughs> <laughs> and she's like balancing really good. Like she seems to be into it now. Yeah. Look at her. Look at her. Yeah. I couldn't play these ball games right now. <laughs> <laughs> that 
looks sexy. Oh. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh my god. Oh damn. What's cooking tonight? Uh, curry. Curry. With all We're the having... veggies. Oh yeah. All of them. Oh yeah. Look at these. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Oh. We were all on a high of happiness and gratefulness sailing together into the next magical sunset. Agua. Oh. <laughs> That's me. Yeah. I'm the water boy. <laughs>